Good afternoon, I'm Spencer7x7 from the channel, AwesomeLane7x7. I am here to conduct a brief interview since you're trending right now. You're here to interview me? How exciting! It's my first time getting an interview! Anyways, first of all how does it feel to be trending on Twitter? GGG trending on Twitter? I wasn't aware. This is the first time people have noticed me. I'm not used to having my voice heard like this. It's both pleasant and embarrassing. Well, some people aren't pleased with your new outfit. My new outfit? Oh, I see. It was designed by the commander to be more, how do you put it, to draw more attention. I'm still not sure how to feel about it. It does make me look bigger and bustier. Does it suit me? I'll read some of the reactions they said. I'll warn you some are extreme. Um, well, okay, I'm listening. Ahem, that doesn't even look anywhere close to attractive, I'm sorry. Hmm, they certainly sound critical to my outfit. I was aware that not everyone would like it, but this hurts a little. The commander and my sisters said it looked nice. Here's another one. For the love of God, can we please give women appropriate clothing for the appropriate setting? This is ridiculous. Those aren't even clothes ATP. It's just an open robe and a thong. Creepy. Ah, it appears that the criticism has increased. But I suppose wearing different types of outfits is part of a Kansan's role. I wish to dress in something my commander would like. Would you say it looks... inappropriate? I think it looks nice. Really? Thanks! I guess everyone has different opinions on the matter. I'm glad you think it looks okay. Anyways, there's more. Her back must be hurting so much like I feel she has scoliosis and 33 different contractures. Has scoliosis? What? What does that mean? My back is... My back is okay. It isn't bothering me, honest. I think I'm perfectly fine. I don't feel any soreness. Is it that bad? Finally, there's one person out there who is wanting a breast reduction. A uh, reduction? I thought the commander wanted my breast to be bigger. Maybe it's a little... Too big? Is it a problem? No, you look perfect as is. Oh, I see. Thank you for saying so. The commander is happy with my bust size. I'm really grateful to the commander for allowing me to look bustier. Anyhow, there's still the rest of this interview. Yes, of course. I am here to answer any questions you may have, so please, by all means. How does it feel being at the sidelines not being sent to battle? Hmm. Being at the sidelines? Hmm. That's something I thought about recently. I'm used to being on the commander's fleet, supporting them in combat. But it's true, I'm not in active duty currently. However, I do feel like I can do more behind the scenes. It's still my duty to contribute to the fleet. I see. Who do you think is your best friend at the base? Hmm, I would say there's so many wonderful people at the base. But if I had to pick one, I would pick Belfast, the head maid and the best maid. She's very serious about things and always has a plan. I love to learn from her, but she's never too strict with me. I've made some mistakes, and she still supports my decision making. I feel like Belfast is very reliable. Ah uh, yes, I interviewed her a long while back and she was pleasant to work with. You've interviewed Belfast before? I'm glad. Yes, she's very nice and reliable, so I suppose I would think of her as my best friend. What do you think of doing after the war with the sirens is done? Hmm, what shall I do after the war is done? Well. It will be a little complicated to determine. I could travel to different ports with the commander, I guess. I will be by the commander's side for whatever may come. You've mentioned the commander a lot this interview. Ah, yes. I'm a Kansan after all. It is my sole purpose to serve and please the commander. So I would say that the commander is my whole world. I admire them very much. You have a lot of girls competing for the commander's love. How do you intend to win? Me? Hmm. There's plenty of wonderful ships at the base. They're all really nice and sweet. If they want to compete for the commander's love, I guess there's nothing much I can do. It's up to the commander to decide. All I can do is try my best and be the best Kansan I can be. One weird question. If you could be any other hull type, what would you be? If I had to choose, I would choose to be a destroyer. They're very energetic and fast. I'd love to race against my sisters whenever I have free time. But I suppose I'm fine with being a battleship too as long as I can serve and make the commander happy. Yeah, I don't think you have the body of a destroyer. Looks at her whole body closely, it's a bit too voluptuous. Hmm, my body is too voluptuous? You seem to be staring. Hmm, but you bring up a good point. I don't think my body is right to be a destroyer. Perhaps a cruiser would be a better suited body type for me. Yeah, probably. Anyhow, that's all the questions I can think of. Anything else you want to say to the haters on Twitter? Haters? Oh, haters. 
Well, it's true that there are people who dislike me, but that's okay. I'm sure if they knew me in person, I can make them like me. I love interacting and having fun with the people in my base after all, but I don't want to be too self-centered. I'm here to please and support everyone at the base. You're a kind soul. Can I give you a hug? You may give me a hug. I'm glad to know I'm recognized for being kind. Being a Kansan is all about supporting everyone and being of service to the fleet and the commander. Opens arms wide. Uh, hug. Hmm. I'm not used to giving hugs or receiving them, but I won't say no to a hug. It sounds nice. Please do give me a hug. I will accept it with appreciation. Gets closer and hugs her. Uh, a hug. It's very comforting. Thank you for giving me a hug. I really like it. Anyways, have a good one. Ms. Cashino. Yes, you too. You've been very thoughtful to give me this interview. If you need me for anything else, you know where to find me.